Hi, this is Perry from Mesa Digital Marketing, and today I'm going to show you how to center a button using the drag and drop editor visual composer for a WordPress website. So this is the front end of the site that we're going to demo, and it just has this, uh, this is all in visual composer, this is a parallel or a parallax background here image, and then some text over top. So anyways, we're going to just pretend like we need a button just above the key products uh, section here. Maybe we want to link to the store or something like that, and we want it centered. So here is the inside of the page of the back end Visual Composer settings. And it's a similar idea on the front end. First thing you're going to do is add a row. So I've added the row to put it here. And then you're actually going to want to add a second row most of the time. So you could just do this um, straight from one row, but best practice is to add a row inside this row. And you can only add the second row in there. You can't add any more, just a note. So then we're going to add the button. So whatever button you have, your theme might be different. Um, you can use the default button, but uh, we're just going to say to the store here, add your link, etc. I don't think this uh, demo one has a store, but okay. So if I save it as is now, it's still going to be on the left. But what you want to do is hit this pencil icon for the row, editing the row, not the one in the middle for the column. And now you just want to do text align center. Save that update the page. We're just going to refresh it here. We're not going to have any padding, so it's going to look a little weird. There's no space in between, but we should see a centered button. And there it is. So this is how you can edit and center a button in the Visual Composer plugin. Hopefully it's useful for you. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.